This is Africa's Sahara Desert, as seen from the International Space Station's new seven-windowed cupola. Astronauts open the shutters of this new picture window in space before dawn Wednesday. We're T-minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. We have Endeavor blasted off, Four, two, two, off from Florida to the space station last week, carrying the cupola attached to the new module called Tranquility. I don't think space station's ever going to be the same after uh, this. Spacewalkers bolted the cupola to its permanent Earth-facing position earlier this week. But the shutters stayed closed until after astronauts removed the window's protective covers during a nearly six-hour spacewalk Wednesday. Bob Dempsey, at the Johnson Space Center in Texas, is the lead International Space Station flight director for this mission. Sitting at, uh, in my chair in Mission Control, looking out at the view, was just spectacular. And the astronauts who are accustomed to views that you and I can't really describe uh, were moved to tears when they looked in, uh, out the windows of the cupola for the first time tonight. Others at Mission Control shared similar sentiments. Now we're admiring your handiwork. Dempsey said the cupola conjured up images of the spacecraft in the famed Star Wars movies. It uh, looks a little bit like the Millennium Falcon, but it's an uh, incredible view. I know we've already had uh, one photo uh, tweeted from the International Space Station on Twitter. Japanese astronaut Soichi Noguchi sent that image. NASA says more panoramic pictures from inside the cupola should be available this week. Suzanne Presto, VOA News. Uh, if you would, uh, EV-182, check your SCE 